Hello. In this video, I will show you how to control the axis with a Festo PLC. We have already put the controller into operation. We need the Festo Automation Suite to program the PLC. For this video, I use the following components and software versions. And now I connect my computer to the PLC. And the PLC to the controller. I go to Festo Automation Suite and click on the magnifying glass. The PLC is searched and we can add it to the project. By double clicking on the PLC, we can see the programming area. By hitting the programming tab, we can be able to see the programming area location. And on the left hand side, we'll be able to see the application. Click on that, add object, and add POU. On the right hand side, we see the programming elements. We can now take the building blocks, box. To switch on the motor, we need the MC Power Festo. By clicking enter three times, we can auto declare the variable. Let's bring in another box so we can move the axis with MC Jog Festo. We n now we need to assign the blocks to the controller. We find the controller name on the left panel and we can write the input name. We need three variables to control the function blocks. One for enable, one for jog positive, and one for jog negative. Call this x enable. We'll do one for jog positive. And lastly, one for jog negative. We need to add the POU to our main task, and we can do that by dragging in the POU like such. Let's make sure that we have our connection by selecting our address and hit apply. Next, we can hit connect. Then we can just download. Once we have our start on, we'll see that we have our connection screen on the left hand side. And now we can turn on the motor. You'll notice that we have our true bits for our status and our valid. Once we have that, we can jog positive. We can also jog negative in the other direction. And this is how you control with a Festo PLC. In the next video, I will show you how to control with a Beckoff PLC. Thank you for listening and see you then.